So let's go back to this statistic, and I want to repeat it sure, again because it really sure. is alarming. Five million people in the U.S. experience at least one migrant attack per month. Yeah. So you're not surprised by this? No, not at all. Is it, you know, because we're hearing about it more and more, and yeah. I always, every time we're hearing about things that are more prevalent today, my first question is always the same. Is it just the, the stress that we're living under? Yeah. Is it just what we, what we see here? You know, in Miami, people, they're, they're running around, the parking, it's more congested than ever. Stress! All of it. All of it. It has all to do with stress. I think the biggest trigger is stress on top of everything else. Because I mean, we can't deny that obesity and being overweight is right. A there big are conditions, deal. but uh, there are several conditions that trigger migraines. But stress is a, a most primary thing that we look at when we're dealing with migraine triggers. All right, so let's define exactly what is a migraine mm -hmm. as opposed to, let's say, I have a headache. Okay. The kids are screaming, I have a headache. Very different. <laughs> so a migraine in particular is a headache, but it is a certain type of headache. And when we look at migraines, we look at it from different perspectives. We look at it from uh, where, is it, where is it occurring in the head? We look at, tell me. And we have a 3D image right oh, now. So maybe perfect. you could describe okay. what's going on and maybe this is the actual so, migraine going yes, on? Yes, absolutely. So it is an intense throbbing uh, symptom that occurs sometimes unilateral, sometimes in both areas of the brain, but it has a lot to do with electrical conductions of the brain attached to uh, vascular circulation. And so what's happening on imaging on screen is that you see inflammatory changes. You see cortical responses of the nervous system attacking the vascular structures, causing either constriction or dilation. Studies vary, um, but they also cause inflammatory changes and kind of spasms on the arterial system along with other things that occur with it. So it, it is a very particular type of headache that is intensified and, and defined and diagnosed by multiple, uh, m multiple avenues.